And construction on the project will take between a year to 18 months. Textile production will begin in the next six weeks on a smaller scale in Marksville's old Ace Hardware location and transition to that Garin location once it's complete. A Central Louisiana couple has been named the top young farming couple in Louisiana. That award is given to the top farming couples across the state who are 35 years old and younger. Colin Vidros has more. Just to say that we did what we had to do to get that, you know, it's just a, just a little bit of a trophy to, to hang on the shelf, I guess. Robert and Rachel Duncan of Boyce received the Young Farmer and Ranchers Achievement Award at the Louisiana Farm Bureau Convention in June. This land has been home to the Duncans for over 70 years. Now, after many attempts to win the award, the Duncans can relieve that weight off of their shoulders. You know, we don't have to worry about, you know, trying to keep up with it all and do it all again next year. But, you know, at the same time, it's just a little bit of pride and, and, and just to say we've, we accomplished it and we did it and we worked at it and, and we finally, finally got it. While Robert and Rachel run the farm, the Duncan children also help out in the process and play a part in feeding the cattle. Every afternoon when, when I get home, they ask me if I've already fed and if they're coming, you know, a lot of days I'll go pick them up and bring them back and we'll feed in the afternoons. And, and so when they, when they don't get to feed, they kind of get mad at me. So they, they like coming and seeing the cows and, and feeding and helping. The Duncans will now represent Louisiana Farm Bureau at the National Convention in January. Avery Davidson with Louisiana Farm Bureau appreciates the success of the family in achieving this award. They're really good farmers. Uh, they grow soybeans on their farm there in Boyce. They also raise cattle. They have three girls who are young and learning how to, to deal with everything on the farm as well. Uh, Rachel on the side also has a flower business and that sort of came about because their, of their involvement in the Young Farmers and Ranchers program. Davidson said with the help of the Ranchers program, Rachel's flower business took off, so much so that it was making more money off flower sales than the soybeans were. Her little quarter acre of flowers made more money than eight acres of soybeans. It was very significant how much money the cut flowers made as compared to, to what they made off the with the Dungans' leadership, Davidson and Louisiana Farm Bureau honor their success through this award and are excited to see their leadership grow. Bringing about new leaders, new people who are taking the lead to be involved in agriculture is very important. And this is one of the ways that we show our appreciation for not just the work they do on the farm, but the work they do in Farm Bureau to advocate for agriculture. In Voice, Colin Vidros with News Channel 5, your local station. Robert and Rachel will represent the Louisiana Farm Bureau when they compete at the American Farm Bureau Federation Annual Convention in January in Salt Lake City.